neck. I have another one. This one's super easy. Um, not a Dollar Tree. This one's square. Uh, I've already done one, so I have matching ones, and I got. Let's show you the pieces together. This birch roll from Hobby Lobby. Uh, I think it was five ninety nine or six ninety nine. So it was fifty percent off. So I didn't pay that much for it. I thought that would. Oh, my glue gun is sitting right there. It just touched me. So I picked it up because it wasn't expensive. Um, I used it on another project. So it takes 12 to go around this one. I have 10 here. But it's super simple and easy. So let's just get started. And it's held together with felt. A generous amount of glue. Just stick that to it. And I do every other one for that. It's a little it's hard to put on there, but it's all right. for every other but however you choose to do it is up to you and you can use these for candle holders or flowers, picks, anything that comes to mind, I, I figure out what to do with them, I'll let you know. <laughs> I've got some spare pieces, that's fine. Haha, <laughs> two, that's what I need, but I'm going to cut off this extra. Literally, that's it. Um, almost. So what I did with the other one, I went back and forth as to what. I have a thin buffalo plaid red ribbon. I have the jute. I looked at them all, but I wanted something a little bit more festive. So I'm going to measure it out. Share so you don't really want to put your finger on top of it. You just hold it down on the sides. Lacy? No. Pull the other side around taut. That. And I think the bow is what I spent the most time on. This elastic, and I don't know if it's going to be the same size as the other one, but we'll see. Just a little bit of glue. a little bit bigger than I think the other one, so we'll just modify it. There are tons of ways to make clothes. You can make them however you choose. 
I just wanted a clean, simple bow. You're not going to see any of that either. I'm going to take a little piece. And on the back. Glue it to your finger. And then the tails. Good glob of glue. So it goes through both layers. Joined. And there you have it. Done. So if you enjoyed this, I guess hit the like button, let me know in the comments below. I'm not real good about saying that, but I do hope you enjoyed, and there's, like I said, I have two. So there they are. I also, I have a few logs left. Well, which ones? I have four, so we'll figure out something to do with those. But the rest of them went to this. And all I did was take a old juice jar, which is a craft cheese spread jar, and I glued them individually, actually, cut them apart, glued them individually so it filled in all the gaps and then I took frosted up some of the uh, the Dollar Tree uh, ties and I threw a lighter airier one over it and then I just put some pine cones and it appears one is missing and then some red berries and just got the stem filled in a little bit of the gaps things you can do with this uh, birch log wool. Well, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much.